Cheers! It is 3.52 on Wednesday, which means we are live in the 3.52, and today we have a special location of Two Old Hags Wine Shop, which is why at 3.52 I get to drink wine, so I'm so thankful for that. Uh, but for those of you who may not know, I'm Sandy Moore. I'm the Executive Director of the Leesburg Area Chamber of Commerce, and this is a program that we do every Wednesday at 3.52 to highlight some of our members. So if you're interested, if you have a business that's a member of the Chamber and you'd like to be highlighted, let me know, or let Danielle know in our office. But Today, this is all about the wine and Two Old Hags Wine Shop. So with that, Hello. Oh, Andy. we are here with the owner, Joyce Huey, of Two Old Hags Wine Shop, and she has a few patrons in the bar. They want to say hi. Hello. Some of them do not. <laughs> We've discovered a way to clear out Joyce's bar and say if anybody doesn't want to be on, <laughs> on camera in the middle of the day at the wine shop. Yeah. I have 20 people sitting outside right now. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so Joyce, tell us a little bit about Two Old Hags. Um, for those of, I mean, I can't imagine anybody not being here or not knowing what it's about, but I, I know that there are some out there that are that have not and don't know. So please tell us a little bit about Two Old Hags. How did the name come about? How did you end up being the owner? All of that. Well, from the beginning, uh, sure. the original owners were Beatrick Isaac and Linda Kohlmeyer. Uh, they went into partnership together and they named it the Two Old Hags Wine Shop, kind of as a joke, um, but they did it anyway. And Beatrix has gone back into uh, business with her husband at the dance studio, Starlight Ballroom next door, and I became partners with Linda. Uh, and shortly after that, unfortunately, she passed away, so then now I'm the only old hag. But I have a, um, a herd of stags that help me out. <laughs> um, Ooh, a herd of stags. There's one of the stags over here. That's Keith. Hi, Hi. Keith. <laughs> Just, you introduced it so well. So. Oh, thank you. I, I had to do it. <laughs> Stags and they kind of name themselves. I, that's not what I called them, but anyway. That's what they are. <laughs> but we We have a fun time here at the Two Old Hags. Uh, like say, Linda and Beatrice started the concept, but it's now become kind. It's mine now, and uh, we do things a little differently. We're we're like your local Cheers bar, um, and you know what we do here, and welcome everybody in, and try to be real friendly and and uh, accommodating with anything that they might want. And when you say you do things a little differently, can you give us some examples of that? Okay, we will do a, any party down here. We'll actually, we'll do anything for a party, first of all. <laughs> That's the bottom line. But if you want to have a birthday party or an anniversary party or any kind of a little shower party, whatever, um, it's just you don't have to clean your house. You just bring the food down here. We set you up outside on the table with some, I provide the plates and the cups and the napkins and all that. And then everybody's on their own and, and we have a party. Um, and you walk away and I kind of clean it up. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, and you never know. One of the things I love about Two Old Hags is you never know what's going to be going on when you get here or what might happen once you're here. <laughs> that would be true. Well, and I mean that in the way of, like, for example, there's a, a piano, which we'll show everybody in just a minute outside. And so somebody might know how to p play the piano and they're playing. Or Actually, not too long ago, I had a gentleman, for the first time we're here, he and his wife came by and I just happened to mention it, and either one of y'all play the piano, and she goes, oh, yeah, my husband does. I go, okay, so we'll sit down. Honey, he played for an hour and a half. With, we did a sing-along. It was the most fun thing ever, and he hadn't been back since. I think we scared the bejesus out of him. <laughs> <laughs> I doubt that. Back. So tell us about the wines that you have here. Well, most majority of our wines are from California, but we do have them from all over the world, um, and we got some high-end, and they're all affordable. And it's order time. Go ahead. <laughs> Um, yeah, as you can see, we've got a little bit of everything, and we do have a lot of beer also. we got beer and wine, but the wine, we have a nice selection. We're proud of our selection of wine here, that what we have to offer. And I noticed that, like, when people, maybe if they if they know of a wine, and if you can get it, you also... Absolutely. If they come in and we don't have the wine in stock, and I've never even heard of it, we'll all, I will research it and see if I can, if it's available to me to order for them and happily get it for them. Um, and case price, you know, we get a we get a case price, 10% off if you buy a whole case, you can mix and match, you know, no matter what it is. So. And what kind of, like, a range of prices? So if somebody's coming here and they're looking for um, wine, wine what are, what's the um, range? The range is about 18 to $250 a bottle. But like I say, if you buy 12 or more, I'll give you a really good deal on it. <laughs> <laughs> on that $250 a bottle? <laughs> You can get each of them for two hundred and forty nine dollars <laughs> and ninety five cents. <laughs> so what else? Tell me. Tell me what else. What kind of what? What would somebody expect if they came here on um, like a Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday? You know. Well, actually, it's just it's it's quiet. Normally during the day, we're kind of quiet. We just kind of hang out, and I 
what I enjoy doing is explaining to people about our, our Leesburg area. Being from Leesburg, I'm very proud of that fact. And I don't mind telling whoever walks in the door what there is to do around here and how wonderful it is and, and how I enjoy being here and just trying to point them to all the cool places, especially downtown. I'm a downtown advocate for sure with our DLBA, our partnership, our Chamber of Commerce. We're all, you know, all the all of them work well together and I'm very proud to be a part of all of them and, and to be able to promote our downtown and our Leesburg area. Well, and you are the president of one of those organizations. I am. Do you want to tell? Leesburg Partnership. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm actually proud to be. I'm proud to be that too. I have, uh, you know, for the second year by you know default. But regardless, um, yeah, it's been an interesting run for me. I, I've learned a lot. Learned about our the workings of all of these organizations and how well they do work together. Well, okay, and talk a little bit about being a downtown business because I think one of the um, best things about being a downtown business is the family. Absolutely. That, that you are part of the family. So tell us a little bit about we that. We are one big happy family down here, and we we do promote each other um, tremendously. I mean, everybody says, where can I find this? And, 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 and we're all close enough that we know what's available down here. We do self-promote promote within our downtown area, whether it be you know, where to get a sandwich, where to get some Pandora, Brighton, you know, where to get your eyebrows done, you know, your hair done, and massages. There's, I mean, everything is available down here. And, and it, just like any family, there's obviously, there's always some dysfunction, but <laughs> for the most part, it's all Not in my family. No, <laughs> not in Joyce's family. No dysfunction right, there. So, <laughs> well, Joyce, thank you so much You're for welcome. opening up. Is there anything else that you want us to know about the Tooled Hags or anything that's coming up that you want to? Well, and we do, we have try to have entertainment here on Friday afternoons. Um, so that's the only other thing we have going on, just coming down and have some wine. And I will say, cheers to that. <laughs> I will say that um, one of the best things about the Chilled Hags is you always have a friend here, even if you don't know anyone when Absolutely. you first walk in. Absolutely. So um, it's a wonderful place. Let's say goodbye to some of our patrons. Bye. Bye. Tell us what you like about Chilled Hags. I enjoyed it. <laughs> it was my first time here. It was absolutely friendly and wonderful. And and it. And we have a celebrity at the end. Hey, Skelly. <laughs> hey, Skelly. <laughs> Always find friends here. Always find friends here. Very good. All righty. Well, thank you so much, Joyce. And that does that. Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, uh oh. Little glitch. That um, takes care of our live in the 352 today. So thank you so much for joining us and see us next week at 352 on Wednesday. Cheers. Hear me. Mm -hmm. Yay. Oh, that looks fun. Plus 10. It says finish, but it's oh, a little way. Fun. Sorry.